Associates, let's get down to grading some nodes. I got a one o'clock res at the Olive Garden. Victor, what do you got for me? Okay, so if you got that reference, you are an absolute champ. Uh, sorry, I'm a terrible, terrible actor. I can hardly speak out sentences sometimes, so <laughs> acting is just not one of my strong suits. Um, but yeah, today I wanted to talk to or talk about the uh, the Larissa node. And um, first, I'll show you what I got going on and what I had planned. And then um, I wanted to give my opinions on how they can change things, and we can either increase profitability or sustain profitability because at the rate they're going right now I believe the node is going to kill the project so yeah um first let's check out my setup let's see how it looks but I have a referral code for those nodes and it is paper c and then dash one four one one and uh, yeah, uh, there it is. And uh... okay, so all four of these computers right here, um, these four computers were given to me by the Fry Foundation for uh, his uh, deep pin mining. But um, all his software is really, really low um, CPU usage. So I decided to also put nodes on them. I actually have a whole video about putting this GPS node on, uh, or this GPS miner onto a node, which was the ETC MC node, which sucked. And people gave me a lot of flack because I accidentally said I bought it, which I didn't. So, you know, I'm sorry about that. But anyways, so all four of these computers are running uh, the node. Um, I think only one of these computers is running the trial node and the rest are running the light. And yeah, as you can see here, we got it, we got it going on with the Larissa. And then we go over here, we have three PCs. Uh, I got these for fifty dollars a piece. Um, that's that's this this one right here. Their CPU is generally pretty pretty heavy used, and it, if you feel where the CPU is, it's pretty warm. But they get the job done. And then I got this all-in-one PC that I bought, and uh, like it's a monitor and a computer all in one, and it's kind of cool. I like it. I'm it's neat. And um, I was planning on buying four more nodes. So I went out and I got um, four uh, Dell Optiplexes 7050s. Um, they're actually really decent computers and their power supply is only 160 watts. So it probably wouldn't pull too much power. But uh, I've decided not to expand and I've decided to, to stay where I am at because I think I'm at a good spot where um, no matter what, I think I can break even if this project fails or if this project succeeds, I'm in the good. So yeah, and yeah, I. I am totally girl proofing my life because they come in and they see this stuff, you know, just freaking, <laughs> you know, green tax going everywhere. Anyways, um, I'm gonna go talk about the, uh, the node. So here is a $50 PC and the cheapest license you can buy is $50 for three months. And even at current prices, in one week, maybe a little, maybe a little bit more, maybe eight days, this is ROI, and the license is ROI, which that is not sustainable at all. That just gives the incentive for people to pump it and then frickin' dump it, like 
why wouldn't you if you're you know if you if you can ROI that quick why get you know like why hold on to the token at all I know they have changed it now so you don't buy the licenses with uh, LRSN but you buy it with LRS and then it automatically swaps into LRSN and hopefully that fixes some issues on uh, or it's supposed to fix the you know the the Deo is busy um, fix yeah so here are my thoughts um i think they need to get rid of the trial node completely uh fifty dollars for three months is that's just ridiculous uh like i said it brings people in they roi quick and then after the ROI, you know, just keep dumping the coin. Why, why hold on to it, you know? And I, Larissa has much more to offer than nodes. Uh, I actually looked into their website and, you know, I, they've got some things going on. And, yeah, so I think the trial node is killing the project. And I've heard other people in the Discord also agree that they have to get rid of that trial node. Now, here's my suggestion. Um, we should get rid of the trial node and we should introduce a one year license. Now, why I say one year, I say one year because there is not two years left in this bull market. Um, as soon as, uh, BTC breaks, it's all time high. Uh, we usually have about a 280 day average left in the bull market. So we do not have one year or yeah, we don't even have a year left in this bull market. So these licenses, when, if you get the two year one, you know, it's, it's going to be pretty useless for a long, long time. So I, my suggestion, we create a one year and we increase the price of that one year to maybe 500 USD. And then we have another license, which would be like the lifetime license. And with the li lifetime license, I think that should cost like a thousand or twelve hundred, or just keep the one year. And I know that um, they want to eventually sell their own nodes, so keep maybe keep the lifetime on their own nodes like they because i was on their website and i saw that they had like a little computer and then you can buy their nodes but yeah um i'd like to see this project succeed like i said i'd like to broaden my you know horizons uh i only hold on to varus mostly and it would be nice to be able to mine mine something different and hold on to something different versus you know just Varus. so yeah that's my two cents uh if you agree with me you know give this video a like and if you disagree with me okay cool whatever in paperclip fashion i forgot to add one more thing but larissa like before you do something new you have to test net, net it first. Like they introduced um, paying for the nodes in LRS uh, versus LRSN. Um, on like they released that, and then they released um, the hundred trial nodes. They did those both at the same time, and it was a complete freaking gong show. Um, I had all four of those Dell Optiplexes, Opti, Optiplexes set up so I could buy a node and the, everything went to shit. And uh, yeah, so you got to like test net your shit. It kind of remind me of the Fry Foundation where he expands way too quickly and everything 
is disorganized and yeah. So like make sure you like test your shit out before you release it. The only people that were able to get nodes that day were people that know how to API and backdoor and they're the ones that got the nodes. And um, a lot of us who, you know, tried to get that note. I woke up super early that day because uh, those nodes get released at f 5 a.m. my time. So I got up at 4 a.m. and got everything set up to buy nodes and I could not. So you got to make sure you test let net everything. And that is why I am heavily invested in Varus because Varus test nets everything. Every time something new is released, it is it works perfectly fine. So yes, test net everything. You got to listen to me, <laughs> Larissa, like devs, like I'm a big part of Varus and I know what a successful project looks like. So just Make sure you test net. Um, all my affiliate links are down below. Make sure you use that referral code because it really, really helps me out. Um, I and now I have a uh, on cryptid crypt crypto.com. He sells Orbic Joys and Orbic Q10s. Uh, if you use the code Paperclip, you get ten percent off which is awesome. That just got in introduced. I forgot to say it in my last video. And then um, I have all my other referral links down there. I have an eBay listing that shows you how to get phones for cheap. And then all the links to my social media are down below. And the link to my second channel is down below. Some very, very heavy things are happening in my life right now. And uh, there's going to be some big stuff happening on that channel. So, yeah. Um, give give that one a subscribe if you care about, about my personal life. And, um, yeah. And the link to my Discord is down below as well. Uh, a lot of great people in there. If you have questions about anything, any type of mining... Maybe even Larissa. I think I'm the only one doing Larissa in her, in the in my Discord. But questions about anything to do with mining, there's someone has an answer there. Uh, very smart people. So yeah, that is how I think we can fix Larissa. And uh, hopefully the devs watch this and take it into consideration. I think it will prevent itself from killing this project off. So yeah, um, I'll check you later. Associates! I can't fucking do this shit, fuck. Okay, I'm such a bad actor. <laughs>